play. There's more bait. I was just gonna stop catching bait. I was actually putting away my dog machine. But I'll take some more. Let's get another rod set up here. Getting the long bait out there so it won't get tangled with the short bait. Okay, still marking bait. I'm out in 40 fathoms, 240 feet. I'm trying to drift live baits. I'm gonna be really mad if one of these boats runs over my line. Schools of Opelu, something big right above it. I don't know that my bait's down that deep, but it's pretty nervous. Still got that other bait on the balloon over there. Uh, it doesn't really seem like anything's happened to it. There we go, another bait. Really weird run, but I got something on. Okay, that's seeming a little more like a wahoo. a pretty good chunk of line hooked up in like 240 the bait was really nervous at like 50 feet so I finally started letting my line out and that's when it came and ate it I'm marking something right now at like 90 feet trying to take my time. I don't want to lose the fish because I tightened down on it a bunch. The other bait might be getting messed with too.
back down a little bit. Fighting pretty good. Whatever it is. It's starting to come in now. I don't know how much line I have out. I mean, may, might be marking the fish right now down at like 150. Keep the tension. Okay, it's coming in now. I almost got it to him. Yep, there's my leader. Round the nose. Loosen the drag a little bit again. Looks like a wahoo. Long, pretty skinny. Fought pretty hard. I don't know how big it is. like a pretty good one. It's hooked right in the corner of the mouth. That's enough underwater footage. Let's land this guy. Tangled in a pedal drive. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> 
Wahoo! Broke off the scud. Nice. Nice one. By about 26, 27 pounds. Hell yeah. Not really ideal with all these waves, but I need to put the fish in the bag. I think I'm just gonna have to knock it out. Without knocking the spear gun off overboard. go wahoo don't bite my bag there we go We'll kind of move back in towards the same area and do the drift again. Got totally slimed. I'm right by, I'm right by a, a wave buoy. Just hooking the stinger hook just under the skin. That helps to keep aligned. Try and straighten everything out really quick. I'll drop it in. I'm marking some stuff down there. Obviously I don't want to get tangled in the chain off of this. But we'll give it a shot. I'm marking Something pretty big, like 50 feet. And I got that other live bait out there, way down there somewhere. Well, I just had my bait stolen. Okay, new bait on the one that I just missed. Or the setup that I just missed. Got that other bait way out there now. So we'll just free line this one right by the wave buoy. That's how I got bit just a few minutes ago. Hopefully one of these birds doesn't try and eat my bait. Waves aren't big, but they're kind of annoying. I lost it, damn it. That worked. I just stuck one out on the balloon and he freaking nailed it. Oh no, it just came off.